Hey guys, what's up? I'm Jules. Thank you for coming back for another video. Um, if you're new to the channel, welcome. Um, if you're a repeat watcher, welcome back. Hope you guys are having a great day. I am having a wonderful day. Uh, it is snowing outside six inches or so, so far. It's still snowing. I'm going to like, when I'm done with the video, I'm going to open up the, well, I'm not going to open up the window. I'm going to open up the the blinds so that I can see outside um, because it's a pretty it's a pretty pretty sight and days like this I get so much done I'm hoping to get a lot of stitching done today I think that's a good reward for all the hard work that I've put in over the last couple months that I did getting prepared for market um, I am finally getting back into the stitching mood I wasn't in the stitching mood for like a long time before market because I just couldn't relax enough and so I'm uh, I'm trying to get caught up now I'm gonna show you guys my stitching progress in a little bit but um, but yeah the fats finally started so I feel I feel good now I feel rested and relaxed the dogs are all gathering around because they started talking so well, let's get into it um, I don't know why I said that that was just weird um, so 10 days back from market still think it was awesome still think it was lots of fun it was like 10, 10 to 12 hour days every day, but still felt like a vacation. And so my mom felt the same way. She loved it. She had a great time. Next year, my husband will get to go. Zuzu, you can't stay right there. Um, next, next time my husband will get to go. Um, and it'll be a little bigger and a little better. But I, I look forward to meeting even more people and seeing them. Now, I am going to put in the links down below more links, uh, about, uh, the stores that have purchased my stuff and where you can get them. Um, they're kind of spread out all over the country. There's, there's definitely more than a few in Florida, Indiana, Oklahoma. Um, I mean, they're kind of from all over. So, uh, I'll put links down below and if they're one of your stores, awesome. If you want to ever get one of my patterns, you can literally just ask those people and they will contact me and we can make that happen. Um, if your local needlework store does not carry my patterns and you would like to get a pattern, I would prefer that you get it through them to be perfectly honest with you. Um, and I might take my physical patterns off of Etsy. I'm contemplating that. Um, but on the other hand, I don't know. I'm, I'm not sure if I'm going to do that or not, to be honest with you, because I have a lot of stuff on Etsy. So, um, and I plan to put a bunch more on soon because I love the design and I'm so glad I'm back to being able to design. If the table is moving, it's because Zuzu is panting and standing, move, Zuzu, move, and standing on it. Um, and so, uh, but anyway, so yeah, so I hope that, um, I, I'm going to get some designs out soon. Uh, I've got a few black and white, the monochrome ones that you guys like and, uh, well, wait a minute, that I like and that hopefully you guys like. And uh, so I'm going to have all that stuff out soon. Um, I'll do another video at some point whenever I put some stuff out. But it is Thursday morning, not my normal day to do a stitching video because I usually do them on Wednesday night. But I feel like stitching last night, so that's what I did. Um, other news, the stitchy wall is going to get redone. Uh, hubs has got to like reposition all the pieces because basically the stuff that, that was framed and on there before the new stuff, my stuff that's going up there is, um, like it doesn't fit, the, it doesn't fit the spots anymore. Zuzu. She's very needy. Um, and so, so we're going to move. Uh, some things around. He's got to kind of figure out. We're going to take some of these other ones, like my Ronnie Rowe and then my, my Darth Vader one, but I've got a few more framed Ronnie Rose. Um, we're going to move them over to a different wall so that um, this wall will just be all my patterns. We've got the Lioness, French, Gucci, 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 French Bulldog, uh, Twin Towers, uh, Torn Dress, ugh, Raising a Flag. Ah. Eiffel Tower, and and a few more that need to be put up on the wall. Zuzu, no, no, no. <laughs> um, so ah, gotta get it level. Zuzu, go away, go, go do homework. Um, I'm not sure if this is no longer level. That's okay. Um, but we're gonna get all this stuff up. So I'll probably eventually like move myself back away from the wall 
and shoot it so that you can see my stuff behind me. Um, we are going to paint at some point, so we'll probably change this uh, light yellow over to more of a lightish gray um, to kind of match the floors that we put in like a year or two ago. Uh, but let's talk about stitching, because that's probably why most of you guys are here. Um, Wolf. Wolf is the only one that I've stitched on this week. I'm trying to get this one done. It has been kind of difficult to work on it because um, it, I don't know what it is. This one is just mentally, like, I feel like I've just uh, struggled with this one. Let me pull, okay, let me pull that out. I got a strand there. It's just been difficult. I don't know what it is. It's just, it has not flown, flown? It's not flowed. It's not stitched very easy. So but that's all right. No big deal. So here's Wolf, almost done. And uh, just that little, obviously you can tell what I have left to do. Um, about 1,500 stitches or so. Can I get it done today? Possibly, but I'm definitely getting it done before next week. And But there's Wolf. So this is stitched on 25 count. I'm stitching it basically like a what we call 10 stitch or a half cross stitch. So I only go one, instead of a full X, I'm just doing one part of that, half of that X, because it's just faster. It's just faster for me to stitch. I only got so much time, but boy, do I want to stitch all the things. Um, when I finish with that, the next one that I want to start, I know I still have others that I need to finish, but I'm, of course I've got to start something new. I would like to start uh, the giraffe selfie, and uh, because that's my other Nilo, uh, Nashville exclusive. This pattern and the French Bulldog it, are actually not available um, anywhere but uh, needle workshops. And so if you want either one of these um, in the next month, especially if you want it in a physical pattern, check the links down below for the stores. Um, a lot of them have it or they can order it. So they know how. They know how. But anyway, I can't wait to do this one because I think this one's going to be adorable. We'll see, how it, we'll see how it stitches out. I know it'll stitch great because these are actually, when I, when I show you guys pictures like this stuff, this is actually like the the mock-up of the stitching um, from the programs that I use. So this is not like the original picture that I that I <clears throat> converted to make a cross-stitch pattern. This is actually the cross-stitch pattern. So um, I don't like to false advertise if I can, if I can. Um, let's see, what else we got here? We got, let's see, that was Wolf. I still have uh, Mother's Love. Is this Mother's Love? <laughs> <laughs> here you go mother's love um and that's a lot of stitching because this is on again this is on 25 count and um it's a it's about halfway down here i don't know i gotta i gotta really work on this one but um it takes longer because it's color i have to switch colors and stuff so it's a little longer bailey you are soaking wet you were outside in the snow you came in with an inch of snow on you and now you're over here wanting to snuggle it's not gonna work kid i i yeah, even if I'm talking, it's not going to work. Um, and then we've got Sun Worship, which I, I really need to get to the next part. Here it is. Let me take that off. To the next part of Sun Worship. Um, so that, <coughs> excuse me. Um, so I am, so I need to get back on this. I need to put something on my roller frame. And uh, this, this might be it hard to say probably not I'll probably put like giraffe or something on there but um, I need to kind of spread out my stitchy stations again so that I can jump from one to the next whenever I feel like it um, cowboy does not have a lot of work done on it I had to stop at a certain point I can't wait to get this this one this one is gonna be amazing and you guys don't even know I mean you have to go on the store to see I have an Etsy store stitching jewels design um, on the Etsy store. So I know I'm sorry. I'm all over the place. This is just how I normally am. Um, so those are the ones that I have now I have empire state workers, but gosh, darn it. I don't know where it's at at the moment. That one needs a lot of tender love and care. Cause I gotta, I gotta get that one done. That one's going to be awesome when I get that one done. Um, but yeah. And so those are the ones to do. That's my plans for going forward. I still want to bring back uh, Rainy Waterloo Place, which is a cross-stitch collectibles piece. I still need to work on that one and get that one done. I, I, I still want to work on like one project at a time. Um, right now, while the, the business side of things are a little busy, 
Um, I can't get back to work just yet on that stuff, but Old World Map still needs some loving, and um, and I still want to get some of those done that I did before. But I, I, I do need to focus the vast majority of my time on stitching my own stuff. I, I found at Nashville that the stuff that really popped was the stuff that was done. And so the, when people could actually see it stitched up, they were like, oh, that was just amazing. And so, um, so anyway, so I, I think that, um, I need to focus on that, but I'm also going to focus on the design. I'm just so excited. I got so much, I got all day today to do what I want. Um, bah, bah. And then the weekend off. So that's great. Um, so I think that's kind of it. It's not a very long video, but, uh, it's, um, I don't have a ton to share, but I already shared it. Um, so outside of that, everything else has been great. Um, like I said, just super happy to be back home. Um, and to be able to kind of semi relax again and finally, uh, got my excitement level. I was, I was like a, a lump for about a week after I got back, just no motivation to do anything, just kind of recharging those, those dopamine levels, I think. And, uh, last night for whatever reason, everything kind of kicked back in and I am just having a blast, um, working on stuff again. So if I can focus myself, focus is my hardest part. Focus, focus for everything is hard for me. I am absolutely a shiny object kind of person. You guys know that if you've been watching for a while. So I'm trying to move more things up to this sort of, um, front room that we have because I have less distractions up here, believe it or not, but, uh, uh, and get more stuff done up here so that I'm more productive so, than I already am, which I know I'm already pretty productive, but anyway, I hope you guys have a great day. I hope that whatever you're stitching on is meaningful and fun and that, um, that you're, that you're doing well and staying healthy. So, uh, I will see you all soon and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Happy stitching and, uh, check my store out at, uh, you can check it out at either the Etsy store, Stitching Jewels Design, and I'm in the process of still working on stitchingjewelsdesign.com and, uh, but in my copious free time. So y'all have a great day and I will see you later.